here with Virgil, owner of Glass Camp. Go! It's World Cup, you're tied, you're in the finals, 35. Wow. Well, I guess it starts with... Kill the hole! Kill the hole! Get out! Kill the hole! Corner! 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 about right here okay all right guys so i'm here with virgil owner of blast camp what this is practice fuck <laughs> <laughs> my, my, my boy over here is laughing at me <laughs> so this is for my first practice after the second max event i see you boys are over there oh, they're yeah. over there grinding yep. um hopefully you guys win fucking chicago because oh, hey yeah. we need we need, we need to get them back. We need, we need to get them back. I'm gonna ask you a couple questions. Um, hey, possible, Cobra. Get out! Get out! Get out! Kill the hole! Corner! 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 the corner home home only home only home 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 only home only kill the home kill the home how did you start blast camp Okay, well, I didn't start Blast Camp. Actually, it started in 1988 with some different owners. Uh, I've owned it for 13 years since 2009. The speedball part of it's been going for about eight years. Jackson and the guys got the team together. We figured let's throw in a field, and it's kind of grown from there. Do you have any plans, like new plans or anything going on for any of the fields? We got a lot of plans going on. So the biggest one is we're putting in lights, but we're taking our time with that. Hopefully by next season we'll have full lights. We'll be doing night ball and Wednesday night drill nights, the whole deal. Other than that, we got an elevated kind of media tower we're installing here in the next month or so and then some covered pits so a lot going on it's gonna be good nice 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 God! God, Ryan! Uh. Get out! Get out! You're gone! Get out! Hey, kill, kill center! Hey, Delta! 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 Favorite NXL moment with your Blast Cat boys? Oh, ooh. Plug. Uh, favorite Blast Cat moment with the boys? There's two. 
The Astro event was pretty special, and that was on my birthday weekend and everything. It was just an amazing weekend. That was pretty special. Chicago win last year in the rain. That was epic. I was there. I was pitted for you guys. That Dude, was, yep, yep. Awesome. It was it was an amazing thing because it was just Midwest, and it was raining, and we beat all the top teams. There were close games. It was just an amazing thing. You know, I will say this, though. My top paintball moment at, at all is watching Jackson play Team USA in Amsterdam. Dude, that was the worst, muddiest event we've ever ever been to but it was also epic as that's hell. fucking awesome yeah. hey get out Hey, kill the echo! Kill the echo! Ryan, take the inside! Ryan, go on the inside! Hey, hey. hey. Get out! Your elbow! Your elbow! Check your elbow! Hey, kill the W! Hey, 50 snake! 50 snake! You're good, get out! All right, so one question I did ask your son, and what I want to do is ask all your, your boys, their dream team, your starting five, say it's World Cup, you're tied, you're in the finals, who are you sending out there? Your dream five, starting five. Wow. Well, I guess it starts with Jackson Frey in the center. That's got to be where you start any good team. Honestly, you know, oh, man. You got him. Yeah. We, I we got say, him. I got to say all love to Ronnie. He's got to be over on the D side. Boy, Nate's got to be right next to him. Cody's got to be over in the snake. Maybe Marcelo, just to bring it all together. What okay. the hell? Okay, I got you. So you pick some of your boys, and you got some other pros in there, too. I like that. Dude, you're I'll tell you, you're on to something because I think a lot of our guys have great stories and people know them. You talk to Kyle Baran, the dude's got some stories and he's been in paintball doing it a long time. You talk to a John Eckerd, has been around for 10, 11 years. He's got stories, awesome story that I feel like needs to be told. A lot of these guys do, they're all very special, especially with, within the Midwest community, you know? Let me know who you guys want me to interview next. I'm going to try to get Cody next, but he's been kind of busy recently, so. We'll see who we can get. Like you're saying, get Kyle. So Kyle's we're gonna try. Story. We're gonna try to get Kyle, and um, we'll go from there. All right. Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, share, do all that fun stuff. We'll see you.